and this is Kitchen Love with Hello Chef Dan. Hi Miss Grace. Okay, and New Year to kaya let's do a new twist on an all-time favorite. Because I think I don't know anybody who doesn't like adobo. Meron ba tayong any person kaya who'll say, I don't eat adobo na Pinoy? Parang wala na. Parang wala po. Yun din po kasing kinalakihan natin. There are 79 million types of adobo in the Philippines, depending on where you are. Nagay na po ako ng oil. Anong oil ginamit mo? Ah, uh, ito po, olive oil. Olive oil? Opo. Okay. So, initin lang po natin, tapos gisa na tayo ng bawang. Okay. Add ko na po yung garlic. Bakit ganyan ka finely minced yung ginamit mong garlic? Uh, ang gusto ko po mangyari kasi, uh, mamaya habang nagsisimmer siya, matutunaw na siya dun sa sauce. Oh, Tos, okay. Uh, tutulong siya magpalapot ng sauce natin, mama. Tapos kahit light brown lang po, tapos lalagay oh, natin. Oo, oh, kasi baka mag-burn. Tapos papait na everything. Tapos pwede na po yung baboy na natin. So ito iba brown? Papa. Okay. What cut are we using? What part? Ito po, ma'am, adobo cut na kasig. Tapos yung mga brown bits po, okay lang po yan. Dahil mamaya, pag nilagay natin. We like natin, that. So, Chef, anong ginagawa pa natin? Waiting pa tayo na mag-brown. Opo. At uh, mag-render. Mag-render. Tapos ito, makikita nyo na po. Dahan-dahan na po siya na-render. Yung yeah. mantika ng baboy. Ang dami, oh. Opo. Yeah. So, actually, that's when you'll know that the quality of the pork is good and it's not yung napaglumaan na pork. Kasi pag hindi nag-render, alam mo yan na medyo matandang pork na siya. Yung parang matagal na siyang nandyan, tapos hindi na benta. Okay. I have a question because people are very particular about what vinegar they use. Ikaw, anong ginagamit mo? Sa bahay po, preferred ko yung templado na ng vinegar, pinakurat. So, oh, really? Opo, yun talaga yung ginagamit ko. It is Janice de Belen who told me that para daw hindi nagko-compete yung flavor, the pinaka-ordinary vinegar okay. is, is good, but Ako na realize ko sa kaka experiment, half of that and half of the apple cider vinegar. Masarap siya. Okay. You, and then, pag minsan gusto ko umarte arte ng kote, nilalagyan ng kotting ano balsamic. Pero kotting kote lang. Para may kotting arte arte, lalang. So later on, angat naman po yan. Beautiful. So, pwede ko na po i add yung vinegar at this point. So, lagay na po natin. Ah, hindi ka ba vinegar ah? Wala kang asim. No, <laughs> That's all uh, you're putting. Kini, kasi ako super, I like maasim. So, at this point, pwede na natin siyang biskisin para yung kulay niya mapunta na dun sa sauce. Yung I suwa. can smell it. Like, Aba. parang sumingaw na siya. So, that's okay. Uh, lagay na po natin yung, para mag-improve yung lasa ng... Ito na si Leon Perez. Opo. I-emphasize ko lang na ang um, Lian parents actually don't mistake it for soy sauce because it's like totally different. Parang it's like apples and oranges na ganon. But it is an enhancer. Kung gumagamit kayo ng soy sauce at dagdagan nyo ng Worcestershire, lalong sasarap. Yes. Yun ang, yun ang effect niya. Sa recipes namin, dun sa ano, uh, meatloaf ng mom ko na binabaluta ng bacon, meron. Meron dun sa meatloaf niya. Tapos dun sa Swedish meatballs na tinuro niya sa akin how to make, meron din. And then, meron akong version ng roast chicken, pero puro chicken breast, na yung Iberian chicken na nakabottle na, na maraming garlic. O, oh, ibababa dun. Tapos, nilalagyan ng seasoning and the Lian parents. Tapos, ibibake mo na with butter and ang saya mo na. I think that 
it's important na nalalaman ng tao that you can use it for so many other things yes. and not not really just not limited. For, yes, not just for steak. And I think lalo na pag ano when when you're making anything with ground beef or ground round, mas lumalabas yung sarap niya pag okay. naglalagay ka. So, yes. At this point, pwede na po tayong magrain ng soy sauce. Mix lang po natin, 1 to 2 minutes. Lagyan na po natin siya ng water. Tapos, ah, why? Uh, para po palambutin. So, you're gonna put water? Yes, ma'am. How much? Uh, just to, not to cover, pero may makikita pa rin po kayong karne na nakaibaba. And then, you're going to let it... Simmer po. Para yung flavors niya, manunot talaga siya sa loob. So, yung bay leaf po natin. Sige, mga tatlo lang po. Okay. How much is a bottle? Ma'am, 150 ml, uh, 98.30. Uh, 290 ml, 167.50. Ito. 150 ml is 98 pesos and 30 centavos. 290 ml is 167 pesos and 50 centavos. And when you have this in your pantry, or kunyari may mga bisita kayo, they're, they're automatically gonna say, it's a social house. Meron silang Lee and Parents. Alam mo, may kasosyal na, na binigay ang Lee and Parents dun sa kulay. Opo. And ano ah, I didn't think that it was that price friendly. No, but I, I really thought it was more expensive than that. Ang Lee and Parents, it's the original that is really from Worcester, England. Yes. Sabi nila, ang correct pronunciation daw is Worcestershire. Pero akala ko all along it is Worcestershire because New Hampshire. Yes. Yung Masambian parents. So, it is really impressive. You, you did something new and that's so hard na a classic Filipino dish to add a new twist and to add something that's British in something so uniquely Filipino. And I'm sure lahat ng tao ngayon, pag nakita nila to and experience nila, sabi nila, oh my gosh, ang adobo pala can still be improved. Is it malambot na? Uh, check ko lang po. Pressure. Ako na lang, tagal. <laughs> there. Oh. Sige. Ito yung hindi inano, Parang nag-render na lang at lumabas na lahat ng fat. Tingnan natin. Oh my gosh! Mas mega god! And I learned something new from you because you didn't really put that much vinegar and you didn't put... You put super konting soy sauce lang but the Lee and Parents flavor, parang both the vinegar and the soy sauce, lalo pa niyang napasarap talaga. Super sarap. It's so impressive. It is really. Lee and Parents, we reveal the secret that it is that needed ingredient for us to create one of the best adobo dishes I've ever tried. Oh, Thank and you. that's saying a lot, ah. Thank you so much, Chef. Thank and you, this sir. was Kitchen Love.